Hey, good Sunday morning, everyone. It's Eric here with a quick video blog for you on this middle part of the three-day holiday weekend for many, with Labor Day coming up tomorrow, the unofficial end of summer. And summer's going to make a quick comeback a little bit later today, but more so tomorrow, just in time for Labor Day. Hey, don't forget, I'll be at the Canfield Fair this afternoon from 1 to 5 in the WFMJ tent. Stop by and say hi. We'll sign bags and... and uh, uh, picture cards and uh, just uh, chat with you if you want to stop by and say hi. We love meeting our, our viewers at the Canfield Fair every year. And yesterday, of course, I got a lot of comments about how cold and damp it was. Today is going to be a transitional day. Improvement is coming our way. The overnight showers continue to push off to the east. Really, at uh, just about 9 o'clock this morning, the only little spritzes left are north of I-80. For the most part, we're, we're drying out right now, and this process is expected to continue for the rest of the day today. Now, you can see off to our west, closer to Akron, up towards Cleveland and uh, Sandusky, we still have a decent amount of clouds around, but I'm expecting these clouds to thin as we get into the afternoon. The morning may still be rather cloudy. But as we get into the afternoon, expecting uh, somewhat uh, brightening conditions and uh, warmer weather as a result uh, coming up for later on today. So uh, hang in there. The weather is certainly going to improve. Our, our uh, model shows, uh, again, the showers pushing off. We're dry this afternoon. Now, it's not exactly going to be a real warm day today. Better than yesterday. But here's a look at today's highs. And uh, here across northeast Ohio and into northwest PA, you know, we're talking about 69, 70, maybe 71 or so if we are lucky. Certainly improvement over yesterday, but not quite back to where we should be at this time of the year, which is still in the, uh, in the upper 70s. We will get there eventually. Uh, again, our Labor Day is looking fantastic. This is tomorrow afternoon. A cold front tracking our way, uh, but that cold front uh, is still well off to our uh, west during the day tomorrow. It's up here. So we're going to get into a breezy afternoon, and again, summer making a comeback with highs in the lower 80s for your Labor Day. What a beautiful day we have coming up for tomorrow. Our next chance for rain is tomorrow night and into Tuesday morning. As a lot of people head back to work and school, uh, especially if you're a real early riser on Tuesday, you'll probably encounter some raindrops. I think we're drying out fairly quickly by lunchtime and into the afternoon on Tuesday, but temperatures will be dropping. Uh, a big change coming our way again for midweek. We're talking highs by uh, Tuesday afternoon back into the lower 70s, and then we probably don't get out of the 60s for the rest of the week. So again, it's just a cameo appearance by summer coming up uh, for tomorrow. In the meantime, a better day today, a lot better than yesterday, especially by this afternoon. So again, whether you're heading to the fair or doing anything outdoors, uh, hang in there a few hours and uh, we look for much improved conditions this afternoon. Don't forget to check out meteorologist Andrew DePaulo's forecast this evening on 21 News at 6 and 11. I'll see you back in the studio on Monday. Have a great rest of your Sunday, everyone.